Kansas schools are being graded the same way your kids get graded on a scale of A through F. KSNT News reporter Gretchen Kanan is live to explain how local schools stack up. Gretchen? Jace Brook here at Topeka West High School. They saw improvement based on the Kansas Policy Institute's new A through F grading scale. It's one of four schools in the district that saw improvement based on the new system. Today, dozens of people packed a Topeka school board meeting recognizing all schools in the Topeka Public School District for their improvement in state testing. During the meeting, the president of the Kansas Policy Institute, a nonprofit research organization, awarded four Topeka Public Schools for their success on a new scale they've created. What we've done is take the state assessment data that we get from the Department of Education uh, and use their descriptions to translate that information into letter grades. He says Loman Hill Elementary School, Quincy Elementary School, Topeka West High School, and the former Shaner Elementary School, which is now a part of Jardine Elementary School, all showed improvement on the scale between 2016 and 2017 test scores. By looking at the schools that are doing better, that we can all learn something uh, about what's working in some places and try to replicate that across the state. Only one Kansas school received an A on the scale. Misty Kruger from Topeka Public Schools says they also use data from the Department of Education to evaluate how schools are doing. We use that pretty heavily to be able to show are we teaching effectively, are we teaching at the standard that the state has set to be able to meet those measurements. Kruger did not name the schools but says a few did decrease in one measurement area but also schools saw improvement in at least one area. She says she's happy other entities are recognizing school success. 2018 data is not yet available, but Dr. Tiffany Anderson, the superintendent for Topeka Public Schools, says the preliminary numbers show continued improvement in many, if not all, of Topeka Public Schools. Reporting live in southwest Topeka, Gretchen Kanan, KSNT News. All right, Gretchen, thank you.